in jail this morning. More than 100 charges awaiting him in court as officers are calling it a gruesome animal cruelty case. Megan Schiller joins us now with details on those charges and what officers found at the man's West End home. Good morning. That man told police that he got the animals for free online, and when they asked him what he was planning to do with them, he said that he was going to butcher them and eat them. But the things got out of hand and that he was too proud to ask for help whenever they quickly overwhelmed him. The suspect is 52-year-old Dennis Safranco. He owns the double home on Arnold Street in the West End where this happened. Now, the yard looked a mess filled with cages, old bags of rabbit pellets, and food bowls filled with wet leaves. It was a neighbor that called police to alert them of this situation, and it was when officers arrived that they found the dead animals strewn throughout the backyard. A family member told police that he hadn't been near the home for quite some time, and police believe that he hadn't fed or given the animals any water. That he was overwhelmed. And in all honesty, there's no excuse, no excuse at all to treat an animal this way. Animals need to be taken care of. They count on us every day for, for care. So there's no excuse. It was a total of 56 animals that were found deceased on the property. 33 chickens, 18 ducks, and five rabbits. The suspect told police that he lived alone and that he was suffering from some health issues, including mental health issues. One thing the police did say is that they would they would really like anyone who suspects any animal abuse or neglect to not hesitate and to call police right away. They say this situation might have been prevented if someone had called earlier. We are live this morning outside of the Allegheny County Jail. Megan Schiller, KDKA TV Morning News.